The United States vetoed a U.N. resolution that called for the withdrawal of President Donald Trump's Jerusalem decision. Fourteen council members supported an Egyptian-drafted resolution that expressed, quote, deep regret at recent decisions concerning the status of Jerusalem. This was in reference to President Trump's decision to move the U.S. Embassy from Tel Aviv to Jerusalem, therefore declaring Jerusalem the capital of Israel. Actions taken by the special counsel to derail the president's decision are a quote, insult, according to UN Ambassador Nikki Haley. Haley added, the U.S. veto of the resolution is in defense of American sovereignty and America's role in the Middle East. Tens of thousands of people in Arab and Muslim countries protested the decision, but as Trump noted on Twitter, several of his predecessors, including George W. Bush and Bill Clinton, called for the embassy to be relocated to Jerusalem during their tenure, but failed to do so. President Obama didn't specifically call for the relocation, but he did refer to Jerusalem as the capital of Israel. Following the U.S. veto, Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu thanked Haley and Trump in a video message posted to Facebook. Thank you, Ambassador Haley. On Hanukkah, you spoke like a Maccabee. You lit a candle of truth. You dispel the darkness. Israel strives to host all embassies in Jerusalem since it captured the land in the 1976 war. While Palestinians believe the city's eastern sector should host the capital of an independent Palestinian state.